before. Myself, I like Count Monier's sight. A faster sign here. Faster. The dressings, bandages. What's that about? The dressings, bandages. Where did I put them? Forget it. Bandages won't do him any good. What? Oh, but he breathed still a moment ago. Mm-hmm. Breathed his last then. Bled to death. Legs broken, femoral arteries ruptured. Wound like that, you're dead in minutes. Gods. What happened here exactly? I... I was rolling through, fully loaded, when I heard screams. This one crawled towards the road, then drooped to the ground, lost consciousness. I jumped down to help him, dress his wounds. Then you appeared. Stand and step away from him. What? Me? But what is your grief? Don't make me say it again. That's good advice. Good advice? Yeah, go for it. Will you tell me what it is you seek? Needed to see if you were lying. You'd be covered in blood if you dealt those wounds. Just got it on your hands, though. So all's in order. Who? Who might you be, precisely? A witcher. Oh. Uh, 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 do, do, do you expect some beast might have killed him? Not my concern. Farewell. See what we have here. Legs broken, but cause of death's the wound. Small but deep. Edges unfrayed. Either a thrust weapon or a thick claw. Maybe a wyvern's. Tough to say, and... Mm, breastplate's unusual. Dented. And it's got a patina. An antiquity, I believe. I deal in these things, so... Uh, what's puzzling is... Why did he don it? Not likely to learn that from him. Now to figure out where he came from. From that house, I'm assuming, but need to investigate. Got some work to do. So... So long. Yeah, so long. Don't go into the house. Wait, I will come with you. Why? Gotta be kidding. This isn't a garden romp. Whatever killed him's damn dangerous and... And, and... and it might still prowl the area, so if it's all the same, I prefer to accompany you. Hmm, so be it. But stay close, keep it down, and don't touch a thing. Well, we just have to go here then. Must have been here he broke his legs. Fell while climbing over the wall. Trying to leave the property probably, after he didn't manage to open the gate. Gates locked from the inside. Clearly been jostled though. Something tried to get out. The very thought sends a cold wind down my back. Damn it. Good gods! What the hell's this? Setting for a banquet? It seems so. What's your suspicion? Did none survive? Gods! Servant. Stabbed to death. Over a dozen blows with a sharp object. Some post-mortem. I cannot believe this is the work of a man. It was a monster, to be sure. Silver tableware. Often engravings. Torso punctured with great force. Blow pierced hardened steel. Man on the high road. Breastplate was identical. Throats massacred. One mighty blow. Shield along sides old and dented. Swords ceremonial. And Shea handiwork clearly.
burned alive. Really high temperature at work here. Lepiota, thou art my defender and protector. Thou bringest good news. Ceremonial bowls for little sacrifices. Of what? Please do not say humans. Okay, not humans. We've so few non-humans in Tucson. Fled, then dropped to the ground to douse the flames. Didn't manage. Burnt smells growing fainter. Might have been another luckier soul managed to flee. Doublet scorched. Wriggled out of it, tossed it, then ran on. Something is nearby. Perhaps there's no one inside after. I know you're in there. Breathing's loud and clear. <coughs> Open up. We mean you no harm. Hey, they remain there. Listen, I'm a witcher. I'm here to help you. But if that's gonna happen, you gotta answer some questions first. You mentioned them. Who do you mean? Those... I, I don't know what they were. Spirits? It all occurred to of a sudden. We were staging a scene. The, the, the death of paying homage. There was a flash of light that blinded me completely. I heard cries, though saw nothing. Then felt my own robes were in flames. I broke and ran, threw off my doublet, leapt in here, and it shut and locked the door behind me. They pounded on the door. I I, I thought they would get through. I, I thought I was done for, but but in the end, it uh, it grew calm. Who are you exactly? D Durant Fosher Plamondon de Saffaran. Lord of these lands, and chairman of the Society of Friends of the History of Tuzo. We meet here annually to mark the anniversary of the Elfin Homage, but something like this, why, it's a first. Hmm. So while reenacting a scene from the past, somehow, unintentionally, you summoned a specter, a Korgorath, or a tube, maybe. What? What now? Best thing? You gotta do it again, of course. Are you mad? Would you have this thing kill us? No, don't want it to kill anyone. Precisely why I gotta do my job. Summon it again, whatever it is, and tend to it once and for all. Durand, think I can reenact the pledge? The giving of homage, alone? It was a great, momentous event. The surrender of Tucson's last elf and king. You will need at least three individuals. Uh oh. You know what I'm gonna ask for. Need your help. But I'll understand if you turn me down. No objections? Good. Let's get to work. Start by clearing the corpses. Got some time. Won't start the reenactment before nightfall. Things of this sort are a lot more likely to work after dusk. One last thing, though. My pay. Don't work for free, you know. Understood. Just keep the danger at bay, and I shall be generous. Through and through. I will stand, or rather, sit in for King Ludovic upon the Elfin Throne. 
while you, Witcher, will play the Enche ruler. We must don the costumes. All must be just right. The Vethaf, the Elven King, hosted Ludovic in his own palace upon his own throne, amidst the blinding glow of a plethora of torches. Light all the lamps. Don't interrupt. The Vetha laid at Lutovic's feet a loaf of binnen and elfin bread, thus granting humans rule over seat yielding lands. Ceremonial bowls with elven wine. Gwinoet, the sweetest blood of the land that had been torn from him. At long last, the elfin king grasped his sword and shield, thus symbolically passing command of his armies to humans. Erect in his pride, drew his blade and dropped to his knees, thus acknowledging his final defeat. Lutovic then spake. I accept your allegiance and shall return in one year's time to... Ah! Look! <coughs> look! The statues! Impossible! God's mother! What? Oh damn, they, they, they hurt a lot. They do a lot of damage. That was just insane how much damage he did. Yeah, we're gonna go. We need to go for the mages as fast as possible. Uh, go for Blizzard, um, Thunderbolt, Swallow. I think that would be best. They are not humans, I think. There's this statue, so. Not sure what we'll go for. Oh, wait, they are humans. Are we using Steel Blade?
was the same. The sculptures, they came alive. By what witchcraft? Dunno, specialize in killing monsters. Reviving them, not so much. I... I may know what happened. The statues, you see, once stood in the palace of one Defethov. I acquired them a month past because uh, perhaps I should start at the beginning. This Defethov was to pay tribute to humans, producing statues of this sort each year. Yet he did so but once, for he perished in the massacre of non-humans at the foot of Mount Gorgon in the year 782. It's fortunate he did too, as Tefethev had planned Lutefek's downfall, for he sculpted not statues, but columns that masqueraded as such. Columns activated with words said in homage. Columns that would have turned the king and his bodyguards into so much colorful confetti. Typical treachery embodied elves. Pshh. You're no better. Elves were just defending their territory. You humans took it, but you still weren't sated. Had to cut the elves down every last one. You? What does that mean? You're a man as we are. Yeah, in a way. Just a shame to have to admit it sometimes. Your words? They're wrong, Witcher. But I'll not let you leave empty-handed. Take this for your reward. Farewell. Yeah, that was really... That was really hard. They hit like trucks. Has it tried this mantical gear? Go to the temple. Oh, hunter.
out that is nearby. We'll do. That's it, Roach. Scholars pitched camp here. Should look around. They were scholars. Should have guessed the passages inside were blocked for a reason. Good thing they didn't try to go in there without a witcher. That could be rules. Humming. Place of power. It's gotta be. There was an entrance up here. So this is not the place. How you like that silver? something magic barrier got a bad feeling damn it
Man, this is a big place. Brought the ceiling down to bury his foes. Ended up burying himself, too. I oh, just need to get around. That's all of that here. All the way up there. Damn it. 
Because it's about to heal. We're rather small as well. This will be helpful. 100% crit chance. a lot of stuff No, let's sit back there. At least I found um, that gear, all of them, in that ruin. That's pretty good. Can outsiders sign up? Or is this a closed event? Mind your manners. Not very frisky for a witcher. Thank you. 
One down. You're gonna need to buff up a little bit. Saint Lebioda sent you. I must now repair my wagon. They await me at the building site. So long. Okay, so if we complete that, it will be a statue in the end. Just wonderful. You like that silver? <laughs> <laughs> 